Stop recording. Check. Student detail. Meet dash. Student details dash Excel row. Student details dash Excel. Sheet two table. Align default. Hello students. Welcome to the journey of advanced Excel. This is. 10th lecture in this series and today we are going to cover formulas related to text. There are more than 15 formulas in Excel which are going to help you to perform various functions on text. And we are going to cover all the formulas related to text uh by today and in the next class so these formulas are very useful uh, in text formatting also and in uh, the presentation of your data okay so let's start with first formula So for studying uh, every formula in Excel, you must be able to understand two things. First, purpose of that formula. Second, logic behind the formula. First, purpose of the formula and second, logic of that formula. So let's start with first formula. That formula is text itself. Text formula. What is the purpose of this text formula? You can format any kind of text using this formula. Any kind of text in any format. Let's see how to do it. So we will have a blank sheet for performing this task. Sheet one zero two slash zero. Sheet two table align the sheet one table align default vertical align default zero two slash zero three slash twenty three F two. Zero three slash zero three slash twenty three F three. Okay. So here are some dates. Here are some dates. Now suppose I want these dates in DD MM YY format with dash but but I want full month name full month name I want so what I can do here E3 Zero three slash zero three slash twenty three F three. Zero two slash zero one slash zero three slash twenty three F one. Zero one slash zero G one. Okay. So we will format the date of F one in some different format. This is the purpose of this text formula. It can format any text in any particular format. The argument this formula is going to accept these are value and format first of all it will accept value value means you can uh, type the date or you can <coughs> pass the cell reference in which date is located and you can specify your format so let's type this formula and change this date into different format. Equals. Edit the line left equals. T. E. X. T. Text. Open the bracket. Left parent. Now value is located in F1. F. 1. 1. Comma. Comma. And we want this date in this particular format. So let's. 
Quote. Open quote for typing format. The format is D D D dash M M M M. 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 Four time M will print entire month name for you. Dash. And four times Y. 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 Full day. A full year we want in this formula. So let's close this quotes. Quote. Right there. And hit enter. Align default vertical align default. G2. 01 March 2023 as formula crop G1. So it has given the result 01 dash March dash 2023. So uh, one thing I forgot to tell you when we uh, have full month name. So at that time we can use space instead of dash. We are not supposed to use dash when we have full month name. So you can put space in your formula uh, in your format. And I can fill down this formula and accordingly all the, j all the dates will be changed here. Let's convert this date in some different format. 01 zero slash zero E1. Here again we will type this formula again equals Edit line left equals T E X T left parent value is in F1 F1 same value we are going to have put quotes comma. Quote. After comma and let's type the full format of this D D D D D, 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 D. space M M M M space Y Y why? Why? Close quote. the quote. Close right the parent. parenthesis. Align default vertical align default E2. Wednesday, March 2023 as formula crop D1. See here. Wednesday. E2. So Wednesday, March 2023 as formula crop D1. So I have changed the format. Wednesday. First March it should be there but <coughs> here it is saying that Wednesday because I have mentioned the four times D. So if you know the format code of any particular data, you can change its format you can change its number format with the help of this formula. So this is text. Let me know in the comment section if you are able to work with this. So you can change uh, means if you have data like uh, minutes and hours, meters and kilometers, uh, liters and milliliters. So you can ch change the, the format of particular number into uh, the for example, just let me type the time here. E2. 10. Space. 0. 0. 0. zero. Now align default here. vertical, align default. What I have 10, zero, zero, E2. 10, zero, zero in E2. Now I want to change this number format into minutes and seconds or hours and minutes. So let e me change it with the help of this formula equals text e x t left parent bracket open karenge yaha par and value denge e e 2 2 comma, comma quote h h h, h colon, colon. M, 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 and 
कोट क्लोज करेंगे राइट पेरेंट एंड यहाँ पे राइट पेरेंटिसिस के साथ यहाँ पे जो भी रिजल्ट आएगा अलाइन डिफॉल्ट वर्टिकल ई फोर टेन जीरो जीरो ई टू टेन जीरो जीरो एस फॉर्मूला ई थ्री सो टेन जीरो जीरो हैज फॉर्मूला इट इज सेइंग बट लेट मी नम लॉक ऑफ अलाइन डिफॉल्ट वर्टिकल अलाइन स्पेस जीरो स्पेस जीरो वन लेफ्ट वन लेफ्ट वन जीरो स्पेस जीरो जीरो राइट जीरो ई फोर टेन जीरो जीरो टेन जीरो जीरो ई टू टेन जीरो जीरो एस फॉर्मूला ई थ्री सो इट हैज ब्रॉड द रिजल्ट बट नॉट एज पर आवर रिक्वायरमेंट बिकॉज इट इज नॉट एबल टू रिकग्नाइज दिस टेन जीरो जीरो एज टेन कोलन जीरो जीरो सो लेट मी जस्ट मेक द चेंज टेन जीरो जीरो ई टू इन दिस सेल एट द लाइन लेफ्ट टेन जीरो 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 स्पेस सो लेट मी रिमूव द स्पेस जीरो एंड पुट कॉमा हियर कॉमा Align default vertical. Align default. One comma zero zero as formula e e four. One com one comma zero zero e two. Again, it is not able to make it because it is not able to recognize the format of this particular data. So, always remember the format means you can change the format of particular text to another format, but you must be able to type format code in correct manner so this will be useful in dates and all the things jinke aapko format codes pata hai then next formula is your concatenate some uh, some of you uh, must be uh, aware of this uh, about this formula concatenate what this formula does it joins two or three cells it joins number of cells for example if i typed first name middle name and last name first name middle name and last name in the particular cells d2 c2 b2 a2 a1 Let's type first name here. Middle A name in B. Align default vertical. And align default vertical. Align default. Here. So I have typed these three names. Align default vertical. Align default. Okay. Now I want. these three names uh, <clears throat> to be joined in this second row align default vertical align default a2 align default vertical align default a2 so i i'm going to join a1 b1 and c1 using this formula it is very simple type the formula as equals a noun concatenate c C O N N C A T E N A T E concatenate then open parenthesis left parent and <coughs> type your cell addresses with the help of comma A 1 comma B 1 comma C C one and one. close the parenthesis right parent and it will concatenate your name see one table align the fault word take as ramish or meet as formula overflow in a2 see it has joined these three cells together it has joined these three cells together take as ramish or meet as formula overflow in a2 and take as a1 Take as A one, meet C one, D one, meet C. 
Ramishwar Prop B1. So I have typed my first name, middle name, and uh, last name in three different cells. And I have concatenated these three cells using this formula concatenate. So you can join any two, three, four, five cells in any particular order in this formula. <coughs> so it is very good. Suppose someone uh, says you that, uh, see, these are the first name, middle name and last name and just concatenate in the uh, first, middle and last or uh, last, uh, first and middle, any order you can follow. Just you have to pass the cell references and you can fill down the formula and you will be done with thousands of names or if someone says that uh, the boss just uh, generate these email IDs uh, the uh, na uh, using name first name and uh, uh, the date of birth with the help of gmail.com so you can type these four different things in four different cells and you can concatenate uh, using this formula so I will concatenate my name in uh, the another order the uh, order will be uh, last first and then middle so let's concatenate here by just i will have to change the cell references only and then i will be able to make it b2 so let's do it in b2 equals edit the line left equals c o n c a t e n a T E concatenate left parent. Now last name is in C one. So let's provide C one. C one. Then I want first name. Comma. So A A return one. C one. Comma. And then I want my middle name. So B B convert one. one. Right parent. And hit the enter. Align default vertical. Align default B three. So any order you can follow. Meet A as Ramishler as formula overflowing B2. C. See, for concatenations uh, nation, there are three, four methods. But this is the most effective and most flexible method. Flash fill is also another method, but there are some drawbacks also. But this is the perfect method, concatenate formula. So you can join any two, three, four cells in any particular order. Just reply me in comment section if it is clear to you. The purpose and logic behind concatenate formula is clear to you. Just So let's make email ID using my name. Let's make email ID using my name uh, and with the help of concatenate formula and you can do so in your Excel. So now I have uh, my name Tejas Rameshwar Mete or Mete Tejas Rameshwar in the particular cell and I want to concatenate it with gmail at gmail.com. So let me type gmail.com somewhere. C2. Let me type gmail.com somewhere. But here you will find the spaces. But don't worry, we will learn how to remove spaces. There is a formula which can remove the spaces. But uh, for example, 
we can do this thing we will just uh, generate my email id out of my name <clears throat> okay so let me type gmail.com here meet a as ramish or as formula overflow it c2 and let's type gmail.com here in c2 at at the line left at g m a i l dot o m okay normal person microsoft excel dialog that function is t valid dot space okay so unknown person it as a function let me just do one thing uh, let me type it in quotes because this at is the sign which you can use for locating student that c3 or just let me type gmail.com i will show you how to add at in this uh, concatenate formula let's me just type gmail.com o m space i have typed gmail.com now i will tell you how to add at in this formula align default vertical mail.com overflow it meet a as ramish or as formula crop b2 b3 here i will type this concatenation formula equals unknown c o n c a t e n a t e equals concatenate and then i will open Left bracket parent. and in b 2 comma, comma quote. quote and here i will put at the red ka sign at at and quote close quotes when you want to put anything in formula and you want to, it to be appeared as a text so just put in quotes and now after comma comma after comma i will put the another cell reference where is gmail.com is mentioned so c2 is c. that 2 2 and right parent okay no, microsoft excel dialog there take as a problem with this formula dot not trying to type a formula question okay. so just let Student me correct this right formula there is a mistake in this because my computer is lagging so much so equals o n c a t e n a it is lagging so much so c n e just let me take some time copy sheet one table b3 hmm, okay so let's type again unknown equals c o n c a t e n a t e concatenate left parent b b 2 2 comma quote in quote i am going to put this sign at quote and comma comma again and then c 2 and right parent now we have done sheet one table align default vertical align default b4 meet a as ramish or at mail.com at formula overflow in b3 see it has generated my email id out of this primary information so that's how it works uh, you can try out in different combinations whenever it is required okay now just let me clear all these things and we will move to next for one day is through e home cl clear formats clear clear all clear all student details unknown cursor okay
concatenate equals concatenate then you are going to open parenthesis the first value second value third value and bracket close means you can concatenate two values three four together as per your requirement Yes, so means uh, as per your requirement, you can use this formula flexibly. So it is very flexible and very uh, useful formula uh, of the Excel. Let's move to another formula. Concatenation, it will help you to join any two strings, two, three, four strings in any particular order. Now another way to uh, concatenating the strings or the cells that is very simple uh, instead of concatenation formula uh, you can easily concatenate two or three cells or two or three uh, uh, the inputs which are there in your cells. So do you know any other method of concatenation or uh, the any other thing which can concatenate the cells without using formula. So that is AND operator. No, no, merge cell will merge the content. So it, it is not going to concatenate your cells, uh, the information which is there in your cell. The AND operator is the uh, exact uh, solution of this uh, problem. So AND operator, it will concatenate your strings or it is also used for passing uh, the alternate text in formulas, alternate text in formulas. For example, just uh, let me type two, three things uh, for your means two, three names or just uh, we will type the first name, middle name and last name and we will combine it with AND operator. L we will learn it, how to combine with AND operator. Uh, 